don't think I know now how much I'll miss it. It's been 16 years since Ronald Lewis left Philadelphia for Richmond to become the city's fire chief. And on Friday, Chief Lewis will be closing the book on his career. But looking back, Lewis says he has few regrets. The only one came two weeks ago when he almost made Tina Watkins the city's first female lieutenant. To have uh, a last minute uh, budget cut, just knock those out and then have to go back and tell these same people that uh, sorry, you're not going to be promoted now. It is a very, very difficult. It was very difficult for me. Fighting city leaders on the budget is probably the one thing Lewis won't miss. But reducing fire staff is something Lewis sees as a sign of the times. Even though Richmond firefighters are often the first to respond to a crime scene. I think this administration could be a little bit more uh, in tune with what's going on in terms of emergency services here. But if there's one thing firefighters will remember when Chief Lewis retires, it's not so much that he protected them when their lives were on the line, but that he stood up for them when their jobs were on the line. He's uh, argued with the city manager that we need the staff and we've got, and I don't know that too many fire chiefs around the country do that. I think he's done an admirable job. Uh, I admire his stand. He took on Manny. Now comes the hard part for all firefighters, including the men of Station 22, waiting for someone to fill Lewis's boots. And that's not expected to happen until after the summer. In Richmond, Newland Archinal, News Channel 6.